as we'll get our first look between these two teams. Starts with patience. You got to have patience at the running back position. And Marvin Kinsey watched him last week versus Arkansas. He wears that number five like another Arkansas great, Darren McFadden. They've thrown his way 17 times. The FBS high this year is 21. Not even to the end of the first half. A final play in this first half and a heave from O'Brien. And we've got a catch at the two-yard line by Nate Craig Myers, but he is short, and the clock reads triple zeros. Nine or four was going to go get it. Right idea. Needs a little more distance on that throw by O'Brien. But way to go up and get it, Nate Craig Myers. Joe Burrow, a legitimate Heisman candidate. There's a breakaway run. The answer from CSU, Kinsey goes all the way. A 74-yard response by the Rams. I'll tell you what, Mike. Marvin Kinsey doesn't need much. And if you don't have a guy just for him, this is what happens. The only problem is you got to find a way to get it to him. Makes the throw downfield. They've got the catch. Spent a good chunk of his professional career with the Bulldogs. Kinsey's off to the right side and leaves the defense in his dust. Touchdown, Colorado State. It's pretty simple, Mike. No edge, no chance, but watch the patience and watch how Kinsey glides to the outside. Again. Colorado stayed into the red zone. Tyson Anderson saved a touchdown. He saved the day for Toledo. Because Kinsey again with that inside of four and three quarters minutes. They're back to the line to try and get it right across the goal line. On the sneak, he extends it. Touchdown, Colorado State. All he needed to do was break the plane of the goal line, and he did just that.